Hello, everyone, and welcome back to another glorious episode of Jedi Talk. I am your host, Brad Hughes. I am not here joined by the full council. Um, for this episode, it is just me and Evan, and uh, he's right across from me. I'm used to looking at you over here, but you're across from me now, throwing me off. What's <laughs> up, dude? How's it going? Hello there. A lot is up. I mean, I used to sit over here, so it's kind of like a throwback, <laughs> but over there feels more normal, so I don't know. But uh, you're not going to be here on the second episode this week because no. you are headed, you lucky duck, because the two... Mickey's not so scary Halloween party. Very exciting. Big old mouthful. But yeah, very excited. I haven't been there in 17 years. Oh, yeah. You haven't done the party in 17 years? Yeah, 2005. For real? Yeah, last time I did it. Oh, wow. So, yeah. I was going to do it last year, but then last year happened. Last year happened. Last year was the the boo party or whatever (laughs) it was. I can't do it. That was the worst thing they've ever... One of the worst things I've ever done. So, here's here's where I stand on that. I get during COVID when they were kind of reopening and they didn't know what was going to happen again, not to have the full scale party. I get that part, but the price but, doesn't make sense. But it does. Here's why it does. Mm. It doesn't for what they were, they were kind of marketing it as the replacement for not so scary, right. which is ridiculous because they didn't do enough to, to warrant that change. No. But as an after hours party, they're not bad. And as someone who used to work at that park during the after hour parties, right. it's not busy. Yeah. But it's also, like what you want out of a park. As a certain man named Josh has recently said, that's progress. So, <laughs> no. uh, okay. Um, but yeah, a lot has happened. I will we'll talk are, about things are coming his we'll way, my friend. Talk People about are not Disney happy. at the end of this, but um, all right, we're going to dive in here to D23 stuff. So, this is our announcement episode or like speculation Predictions. announcement. Predictions. That's what I'm trying to say. Predictions. Um, I, I wrote down announcements instead of predictions on my thing here. Let well, me change this. Did you see they um, have said when the 50th anniversary is going to end? Yes, March 31st? Yes. 2023? But they didn't announce when it's going to start. Ooh. I'm so confused. Ooh. <laughs> Evan's throwing shade. Yeah. Um, so here's what I did. I don't know how you did your list, but I broke my uh, list. I have uh, 8 and 8, 16. 16 plus 7 Dang. is... 23. 23. So 23. 23. Perfect. Oh, that's hilarious. I didn't even think about that. No. Um, I have 23, 23. 23 D23 announcements. Um, nice. So here's what I did. I broke them into three parts. I have part one, which is updates slash backtracking. <laughs> <laughs> so Epcot? Uh, there's a lot. Yep. Uh, then I have part two, which are likely announcements. Okay. And then I have part three, which is blue sky slash unlikely announcements. I didn't even bother with that because I know so it's not going to happen. Think about those when you're putting your stuff in and we'll kind of alternate if you want but i have a, or do you want me to just go first and you go first just to alternate just go one okay. one 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 um so we'll start with you want to start with part one yeah. updates uh, slash backtracking so sure. my uh my part one my first one is a tron opening date and i'm specifically saying it is going to be december 1st 2022 that is very optimistic Believable. but there yeah. have been they've been testing people human testing yeah. so that's exciting so that's my first one and um they're going to give us a opening date i'm assuming since it's an update, but uh, I think that's a likely date. Yep. Which, what you got? That's 100% me too. If there's one thing I would bet all my money on from D23, it'd be that. Try an opening date. Opening date, yep. yep. 100%. All right, what you got? My Well, that's my, the first one right off the bat, but like the second obvious one that's going to happen is Phantasmic's reopening date. That's my number two. Look. Yep, it's like that's two number most two. obvious things. Tron, <laughs> Phantasmic, which I love how one of them is basically like what we joked earlier, like churros are back. It's like, Fantasmic is back. back. The show we've had for 20 years is back. I think there's going to have some sort of uh, update as well. I'm True. Guessing, Pocahontas is gone. I'm guessing it's going to have Frozen an Encanto. and Moana. Maybe Encanto. Encanto. I'm thinking Possibly. Encanto. Yeah. I think Moana is not as popular as they think it is. True, but they've kind of already went all in <laughs> with the journey of water. and They're, they're so going strange. all in. Uh, do you have a date prediction? Because I do. No. October 1st. Okay. Some, something they could bring back short notice. Yeah. Internally hire people to come back. They're, yeah. they're probably already doing that. Yeah, d- um, definitely. But uh, that's just a guess to yeah. have it on the 51st birthday. Um, all right. So that was my number two. I'll go with my number three. Um, a nighttime parade at Magic Kingdom. That'd be awesome. That's not on my list at all. I think there's a reason they've had a lot of this uh, Mansion School Parade merch on both coasts because it doesn't ah, really make sense true. to have it here. And true. I think they would have had it here already, which is why you have all the merch here. Yeah. But COVID and all that kind of stuff kind of delayed it and they kind of just kept it where it was at. It yeah. also could be Paint the Night. We've never had Paint the Night here. Yeah. Uh, I mean, that if they went away to randomly just keep, out of nowhere. Keep uh, Electrical over there and give us Paint the Night. Well, Electrical Parade's done over there. So I th- what I think they're doing is I think they're bring, bringing Manchester Electrical Parade here for the 50th, the last part, the tail end of the 50th celebration, and they're going to yeah. bring back Paint the Night at Disneyland. Yeah, that makes That's perfect sense. That's um, because I've heard that like they we can't get paint the night because of the truck, but they could just edit. They could just not just have that take that section that, out. That section like, out and yeah. have it. That, that I never saw it in person, but that parade looked fucking. Or you awesome. could just 
maybe it's more complex than I think, but just take the trailer off the truck, maybe. You know, like there's there's a way to yeah, do you it. You could do it if you wanted to. Yeah. Um, what you got? Um, my third thing that I still think is definite too is the Toy Story Land barbecue opening day. I have that on here too. Like, um, those are the three things for me: Tron for sure, Fantasmic opening for sure, Toy Story Land barbecue for sure. Those I opening dates are coming. I don't think I I had it on my original list. I think I may have edited that out because oh I did edit that out because um, they did announce that it's coming. Right. But I was going to... They gave us a season, didn't they? Now? Yeah. Oh, no. I do have it right here. Sorry. I, it's it's part of my number seven. But we're um, getting the date for sure. I was saying Toy Story Restaurant first look. Okay. Like, a, like still an actual look the on date. the inside of it. Right. But yeah. Not the w- concept art. There's yeah. going to be a camera in uh, the restaurant. Inside the restaurant. They're going to show you what it looks like. Yep. So yeah, that's, I'll uh, go ahead and cross it out because I'm done with that. But uh, yeah, I think for that's for sure, sure coming. Um, another thing I have that is almost a definite is the Splash Mountain updates. And I think they're going to show you... Remember how they did with um, the Beauty and the Beast attraction when they sh- few years ago they showed yeah. that Bell animatronic? Yeah. And everyone I thought lost it was animation shit. at first. Yeah, everyone, I didn't think I, it was I didn't real. think it looked as good as everyone else did. Yeah. I, thought it I do kinda, remember that. But I think they're going to show an, a, a, an animatronic from that attraction. I think they're going to yeah. show that off there. Potentially the animatronic what, from that what, attraction. Because I mean, what else are you going to do? Show us more concept art? We've seen it. We Probably. know what it's going to look like. But yeah. I think they're going to... I think you get concept they art. show like <laughs> the log with a new paint job on it. <laughs> we we patched all the holes. It won't sink. Sink. We promise. <laughs> they're patched. We use Flex Seal. But uh, I think you're going to see the first look at the animatronic there. Yeah, good call. Good call. It might not be shown publicly. Like they might show it separately. True. Has D23 ever done that? Where it's like celebration? Know. Where it's like convention only. See this. I think so. They've okay. had to have done something. I would imagine so. It's got to be something. Yeah. Uh, what else? What you got? Also, I think for sure, this is my last, like, for sure, at least for Walt Disney World, is Moana's opening date for the Journey of Water. I didn't even put that on here. Oh, I, actually, I did. Every uh, day did, they like post a, a new a, picture on Instagram of, like, this rock work is done, and this fountain is was, now installed. I was at Epcot like, last night to ride Cosmic Rewind, and it looks it looks good. It's coming up. Like, really? you can actually see it. I haven't from been at Epcot for a few months now. Like, so, two months, I think. So, when so. You, once you go in, like, you can see it coming up over the over the wall already. Oh, cool. When you, like, underneath I haven't rode the monorail around in Epcot either. I haven't, I haven't either. I need that'd to do that. That'd be a good time to see yeah, it. Yeah, I, I need to do that. I want to yeah. get a construction video going for that. Yeah, that'd be sick. Um, that was your last for sure? For Walt Disney World. Yep. Okay. Um, I think we're going to get a cruise line update because there are supposed to be two other ships coming along with the Wish. We haven't Those heard have the peep. Those have kind of gone silent. Yeah. They've got to still be doing it. Those things Definitely. are all contracted. So Especially with how big of a hit the Wish was. Like, that <sighs> ship looks great. I'm not, I'm People love it. With it. The atrium is the only part to me that looks a little lame. The rest of it looks great. I'm not impressed. I haven't been on a cruise in so long, though. I've never cruised, so I can't f- officially say it. We're going to do one a- soon. Um they're, dude, they have cheap ass ones. Like I think for real. that's my next thing. Is cruise. you guys can go do a three day cruise for four hundred bucks? Dang, out of Port Canaveral. Yeah, it's nothing. Nothing on Royal Caribbean, and like with the best cruise line in the world. Yeah, they I have like they have like short, like short little cruises. Yeah, they'd be a good way to see if you like it. That's what I've, most people said. They like do three or I think three is what people tell me. Go don't to do Royal Caribbean's website. Less. Because don't spend the money on the Disney stuff. You know you like Disney already, blah, blah, blah. But see if you like the idea of cruising. I mean, we get discounts on that, so. Not like this, though. I mean, for real. Both you guys all in. Yeah. All the, everything is like 400 bucks for three nights. That's nothing. It's insane. You can't get a hotel room for that. No. Three nights. No. And it's all inclusive. I mean, other than alcohol, I don't know if you guys would drink that much. I certainly do. (laughs) Mm, I only do on occasion. It's like last night. Two fuzzy tontos. I have a video I want to do. A video I want to do with you and Tom. Remind me to write... I have, I have a, I'm telling you, write something <laughs> down. I have a shit I can write down now um, that I want to do with you guys because I have an idea. Um, all right, anyway, I just wanted to write that. I meant to bring it up earlier and I completely forgot. Um, all right, uh, what do you got? I think we're going to get maybe an actual picture of the sculpt itself of Dreamer's Point at Upcat. I, and then you after know what's that, funny? I have an overarching Epcot one, which is my next one, so I'll go ahead right. and bring it up right now, cause yeah. we'll, and then we can just get to your next one. But I have just, I have an over, uh, Epcot redo update yeah. and 40th details. Right. Whatever that is. Uh, and they'll be it's merchandise. It's just going to focus, <laughs> mer- yeah, focus on the merchandise and the Walt statue for Dreamer's Point. But yeah, that could fall right. into that. And, so and then the after Moana that, thing. it's going to be nothing but, I even wrote down here, just buzzwords. Just nothing but Epcot buzzwords. Yep. So. Dr- uh, Imagination. Innovation, and creativity. Creativity. And, yeah. Just like, all right. Unlike yeah. anything you've ever seen. All the things Epcot Nothing you've be. ever Got experienced it. in the park. Got it. Sim- Which is not a good thing. Distinctly Disney, but still Epcot. There'll be some bullshit like that. The phrase makes no sense. <laughs> is that the phrase <laughs> that, that has that aged shows, the worst? Well, that ever? just shows me that you don't know what you're talking about and you don't understand the company because yeah. Disney was Epcot. Epcot was Disney, both. It, it, was, it, was yeah. two, it was, they were the same. 
Disney yeah. isn't just like that's like he his take on Disney, Bob Chapek's take on Disney is like those people who don't get what Disney is and they go like who would want to go do that? And you're like anyone who <laughs> enjoys fun? Yeah. Like who wants to go? Like I used to get people all the time. They'd be like, "You're going to Disney World again? I'm like, don't you go to the beach every year and just yeah. sit in a fucking chair and look at the waves? <laughs> That's the most boring, get sunburned, like, stupid shit you could possibly do to waste your time just staring at the at the. Like I know, yeah. I know families who, when I was a kid, that was their vacation. They went to Hilton Head Island it's or cheap. they went to Myrtle Beach Man. and they sat in a chair for four days. It's definitely cheap under a tent. And I'm just Not like, fun. how is that? But you're but. You think it's weird that I want to go ride Splash Mountain again? Like, what are you talking? What are you talking about? What are you yeah. saying? I don't, I don't understand it. No clue. Um, but that's yeah, what that, made but Epcot, that's, that's like, his like take on it. It's yeah. like, why would you want to go see that? We could like he's like characters. Like, it's fucking stupid. But that's what made Epcot great. Was it used to be the thing that like there was nothing else like it on the planet. Yeah. But now it's like they're cloning the Frozen ride for France. Like they're closing or cloning a bunch of stuff. Like Epcot's not unique anymore. It's not special. Yeah. Soren is now in. Three, no, four different parks. Like, yeah. Soren's all over. Like, literally all around the world. So, yeah. yeah, Epcot used to be the thing where, like, there's nothing like but it. I, I but don't, now I don't there's things like Soren it. I consider Soren and Epcot. Oh, you're saying, like, it coming from California to be at Epcot? Like, yeah, and now sense. it's yeah. in Shanghai. No, it's in Tokyo and Hong Kong, I think. I think it's Either in Shanghai, way. too. Might be. Maybe it's, but like, six characters parks. of flight or something. They changed it. It's, like, it's yeah. over, Soaring over Fantasy. Yeah, something, something like, like that. that. Buzzwords, something like, like we said. Buzzwords. Yeah, buzzwords. Um, all right, my last one that I think for sure is going to be an announcement because it wouldn't be a Bob Chapek <laughs> announcement unless he was announcing that he's making more money and the dining plan is returning. You're not wrong. Dining the infrastructure is still there. Yep. Yeah. Use it on the house, Jan, So. Yeah. Um, all right, those are all my things that I think are going to be updates slash backtracking. And I think for the sure. biggest backtracking is going to be Epcot because that the new concepts are yep. they're going to show at D23 is not going to look like what they showed the first time. Um, all right, so now we're moving into my part two, which are likely announcements. Um, do you want to go first? You have one in mind? Think that like, like it could um, happen? It could happen? It could happen? Well, for you know, barring uh, another fucking global <laughs> pandemic, it could happen. It could happen. Yeah, I think there's one that is going to happen because they talked about it at celebration. So, and then there's one after that, that that's likely. So the one I think is coming, obviously, because it was announced at celebration, was new Safi's pieces. So maybe that's going to be D twenty three. I don't think they would focus on that. But they might just give us a date, like starting. Remember, I, I agree that they're, they're gonna, they're, that's going to come in like a blog post. I think Possibly. I would imagine because you got to remember we're focusing on Disney World and Disneyland. Yeah, they focus on everything, everything. not just Tokyo, parks too. Shanghai, Disney Plus, Disney Plus Marvel, it's be Star Wars, like everything. everything. Yeah. So I don't think they would waste their time there. Good point. I, th- I think that's going to be a blog post. Yeah. I'm not shitting on your, your pick. No, I think you're right, though. But I, th- I think that's just going to be one of those and things that's where also, like, hey, it's coming. That'll help them also. Or like, it just shows up without anybody fucking saying Yeah, anything. that'll like, they want to mitigate the crowds for that. They don't want like 80,000 people, eBay resellers showing up yeah. on day one to get the new Savvy's yeah. pieces. So yeah, good call. Could I mean, I could be wrong. They could, because it, well, you know what? I, no, maybe, because they only showed the one. Yeah, they didn't right? have a whole lot. They only showed the one power and control, right? Yeah, they just yeah. said like, it's coming. So Interesting. Like, yeah. Maybe. I don't think it's going to be huge, though. The more you talk about it, the more I think they want to like get focus rid of those eBay resellers, else. focus yeah. on big stuff, focus just on big drop stuff. that one day randomly. I mean, but unless they don't have a lot of big stuff to bring up, then, mm, you, then you might. I mean, that's, that's the thing. So, yeah. uh, My likely announcement is a Tomorrowland redo headed by homeboy Scott Trowbridge. One million percent. That's on I my think list, too. I think it's going to happen. I think it's going to happen. Disneyland, uh, Disneyland Tomorrowland. Yeah, yeah. yeah. Yep. Um, what I think will happen is I think they're going to do it at Disneyland and see the reaction and then do... Whatever is kind of like that everywhere take, else. Pick, pick it and like yep. clone, like we said. Yeah, yeah. clone it here. I think I think yep. it's about time we're going to get something announced. Maybe not at this D twenty three, but something's going to happen in that space where um, Stitch's Great Escape and Alien oh, Encounter yeah, used to sure. be. I, there was that rumor forever about the Wreck-It Wreck-It Ralph. Ralph. Makes no sense, but sense doesn't, it doesn't matter, matter anymore. anymore. It doesn't yeah. matter anymore. I, I, I that. think, I think that idea is going to end up in the Play Pavilion. Yeah, that's fine. Which yeah. is which I forgot to bring up was part of my Epcot update. I think they're going to yeah. announce an opening date for that. That works. It's fine. not going to be next year. No, it's going to be twenty twenty four. Because I've seen that uh, they had like they filed construction permits, permits that until expired in twenty twenty four. Yeah, so it's not going to be anytime soon. Which is but. insane that you can't get like they announced it at twenty nineteen. Yeah. right. Yeah. So we're four years later. Yeah, going to be five. And it's by still that time. two years away. Yeah, <laughs> so six years to redo the wonders of to life. A building that already exists. With projections. Yeah. <laughs> it's 
<laughs> so <Projections>. crazy. <laughs> the thing, I like the idea of the pipe Me a too. Lot. I do too. I think it fits Epcot. I think it totally like, does. I think yeah, it's, so that I'm might be why they're that. getting rid of it. <laughs> and you're probably right. You're probably right. You're like, wait, this is actually Epcot? Whoa, Get it whoa, out. Whoa, Get it whoa, out. whoa, whoa, whoa. Well, we don't do that anymore. Except he's like, wait, how many IPs can we shove in here? And he's like, wait, it's oh, infinite shit, because it's a anything. screen? Oh, okay. Oh, anything. Perfect. Yeah, okay. Um, but yeah, jokes aside, I think if it's done the way they're talking about it and the way it should be done, it is Epcot. So I'm here. Yeah, I, I, I've always said I like the idea of the play people. I think it's a it's a really yeah. cool idea. Um, uh, right, was that yours? No, that was you. You said me. Okay, we what? started with Disneyland, Scott Trowbridge, Tomorrowland. Okay, and then we spawned off to Epcot. So, did you say play people or did I say play people? I you did. Okay, whatever. Well, what what do yep. you what do you have? Um, well, for we'll stick with Disneyland. I think we're gonna get. I don't know how far along it is, but I'll say opening date for Mickey and Minnie's at Disneyland. I didn't even think about that, but yeah. I think it's gonna happen. They have said they're getting a scene that's only there. Yeah, which so is cool. We'll maybe get like a little corner picture of it. They don't want to give away the whole scene, but like the, here's a part of that room. I, I, I'm, so, I love that ride. So, is it come, are, you, are you coming around on it at all? I mean, it's growing on me, but it's still something I only do if it's like ten minute. Oh, wait. I, I, I do it almost every time we go. Nah, I love. I it. do it like once every six months. I love that ride. I wish, it had, I wish it hadn't replaced Great Movie Ride. Same. I will say it that. Should have been in the animation courtyard. Yeah, it would have made more should've sense. Should have been, but. but because it is we animation. We use the buildings. Yeah. Um, all right. Heading back over to Epcot. I think they're going to focus on Epcot with the 40th coming up. Yeah. Um, and that, you know, nothing they got. Dude, we need, I want to do a, a podcast where we go through all the announcements that they made and show the, oh, Dallin actually just did this. I so just watched mind. it. It was hilarious. He, great job. He did a fantastic job. Yeah. But uh, nothing came out of that. No. He's <laughs> like, how do you have a whole like panel that just gets canceled? The canceled panel. The canceled. The canceled panel. <sighs> but I think they're gonna finally, and I think this is on the back of even during the pandemic, the figment popcorn bucket chaos. Oh, dude! If that happens, the imagination retheme. I think they're gonna bring back Dream Fighter. If that happens, Epcot's Epcot's back. It's back from the grave. But I think it's not I think happening. It, I think so. I, I really think they're looking at Epcot no hard. Faith. I think they're looking at Epcot. They really are, hard. but not what Epcot is. I think that. Okay, so my 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 out there is the Dream Fighter coming back, but I think they're definitely going to announce a retheme. Oh. I think the Inside Out rumor yeah. is something that could potentially still be around. How many funerals can we have for one park? Because that'll be like the fifth. <laughs> <laughs> I, I think it works. I think if they, as long as they don't get rid of Figment fully, true, one hundred percent. I think I think if Figment, he's gone, then it's I think really Figment really would really dead, work but. with Inside Out, especially since he's like a cameo in the movie. Yeah, that little painting, little in the painting. Corner. I think I think. Uh, imagination and the emotions there, there's something there that w- yeah. would work yeah. uh, of all the I- ips you could put into epcot you could do way worse than inside out for imagination yep like uh, a marvel one yeah well, crazy yeah, it doesn't really make sense but no. it's, i like that the fact that they made it a pavilion me too and the i like that cool. idea the, the rest of it cool. after that idea didn't work but, but i, I like, like that it, idea. i feel like it works because like they're showing it to me it was like a mixture of epcot meets alien encounter yeah where you're going to teleport and then something goes wrong uh, the teleportation yeah. doesn't go wrong but something goes wrong i love that ride yeah. man you're, you're crazy. I'm crazy. You're crazy. Uh, all right, what you got? Um, Shoot, what else? Um, For Disneyland, it, like you said, though, now that I think about it, this is kind of small, but maybe Magic Band Plus talk. But oh, it's pretty no, small. No, 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 so. that's not, because they they've, 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 they made a big deal that those are coming. I didn't even think oh, about okay. this. So yeah, they're, mind, then. they're 100%. That should be my fucking definite one. That's definitely going to happen. Because they have construction walls up in Galaxy's Edge. Yeah. So they're getting it's bounty hunters at the very least. So they're, They've said the full integration of Magic Bands is coming to Disneyland. Yeah. Um, it's wild. Yeah, it's definitely going to happen. I think Even Disneyland like, might have some special designs, which... For sure. Your boy might be buying some of those. For the low price of seventy nine ninety nine. They're fucking crazy. They're, they're not that bad, though. When like, can, what, 35? Can we, uh, those like are 45. 45. Damn, really? Yeah. Shit. Yep. Um, who cares? They're fucking awesome. I kept saying I'm not going to buy a bunch of these, and I've bought like six of them already. That's not that bad, though, because there's like 20 I have, out. I have, when, I have, when you have 200 other ones, yeah, it's not that bad. Not <laughs> that's that what I'm bad. saying. It's all, <laughs> all perspective. <laughs> huh. um, yeah, I think that's definitely going to happen. I think they're going to announce, like, if it's... I, I really hope they announce that they are compatible coast-to-coast. If it's all one account anyway... There's no way they can do that. But it's all one account. so It should, it just, should be, but... But, like, I bet you it's just a continuation of... Cause, so, I don't even know if you know how these work. Not fully. There's not a ticket on this. Right. Like when you when you link your ticket, that's why they use the word link your ticket. Yeah, your ma- there's no ticket. Like it's just an access code in a server. Yeah. So if they just are reproducing those servers, why can't if you're using the same account anyway, and the Disneyland account is the same as your Disney World account, it's two separate apps, but it's the same account. In theory, hypothetically in, in speaking, theory, it should yeah. carry over. 
It should. So I'm but wondering if they'll be if they'll clarify that at all. They're going to clarify it, but I don't think it's going to be the way that is logical. But here's the sense. thing: like, it doesn't matter. Like, if, no, if, it doesn't if, matter. If I if I'm go in there, I'm going to buy Disneyland bands. So maybe they, maybe they won't make it compatible. So you have to For go and buy Disneyland, ba- Disneyland Magic bands. Yeah, I still can't believe the demand for these. Like the Falcon Same. one sold out. I can't believe it's that. gone. I was there today and it's gone. Like it's still gone. I don't. If you see it, grab it because I fucking <laughs> want that thing. Okay. I was going to get it the, that first day, and the reason I didn't is because I wanted the one that was in universe, and I saw Grogu was on it. And Mostly in universe, right. yeah. That's the, my exact reaction. I was like, I'm getting <sighs> that, the Mandalorian one. It's universe, and then I was like, oh, Grogu's yeah, on it's, it. It's annoying, but yeah, that's, one day that's we'll a get good, one though. That's a, yeah, for sure. That's they're, they're turning out these designs quicker than I thought they would. Yeah, there's already like five or six five new, new ones. ones so yeah, in a month, you know, what are you going to do? Um, I'm still waiting for them to do a not so scary one. I was hoping they would do that. We'll get a Christmas party cause, one because there's not a there's not a magic band for the party like branded for the party. Yeah, there's the Jack Jack and Sally one, but that's not a not no. so scary one. That's Halloween the stage one, show but one. it's just Halloween. Yeah. It's not party exclusive. So I'm hoping or, that they they sneak that in. You know, they do that sometimes halfway through the year. Yeah. They'll add. And then like, everyone added, that went to the ears. earlier parties are going to get upset. Yeah. Like, well, they already added do? ears. Yeah. So what are you I, I do? bet you get a Christmas one for sure. Christmas party. So. But I bet, oh, we yeah, gotta, we gotta speed Disneyland gets one we for sure. Magic movies. Band Plus Disneyland. Um, all right, my next one is kind of a smaller one, but I think there's going to be a new pavilion announced at Epcot, and I'm guessing it's going to either be Greece or Brazil. Okay. Um, what else you got? That'd be cool. I'm okay with either one of those. Didn't they? I might be making this up completely, but at Celebration, did they hint Star Tours updates? I don't remember that applies about around that. the globe if it was true because like there's star tours everywhere. Well, I know they so. can. I mean, uh, you'd be silly to not add like Navarro or something. Yeah, just throw in Mando stuff. Something at you, the very least. You but could definitely do it. They, they, I think they, they like were. Like, hey, remember it can always be updated. I yeah. think it was something to that effect. Yeah, you said this maybe as recently as last week, but I would love an official canon star tours. Yeah, but I don't think that's coming. But I think we're getting a new Mando. I don't, I don't need video. It. I, I like. I don't I, need I, it. I, I would, would love it. it. Yeah. If they did it, but I, like I kind of like having just a silly, yeah, kind of like I love old our Star Wars. Star Wars. Wars. I write it all the right. time. Yeah, but I do too. Was, I love if Star it Wars. was announced as a new canon update, I would be happy. But yeah. if it's never announced, I'm still happy. But I think we're definitely gonna get like a Mando scene or something. Gotta be something. Yeah, get, we got we got nothing from. I think Solo, all the Disney Plus Rogue shows One. and TV show and movies. Mando, nothing. Yeah, it's nothing but Skywalker films. It's the weird. nine films. Wild. Yeah, they really should expand that. There's no reason not to. Yeah, you could even do animation. It would, it would make more sense, to. you know. Hundred percent more sense. Was not in those scenes. Yeah. <laughs> that was uh, another thing. Wait, throwing it way back to the whole cameos and Endor. Like Rogue One, that cameo of three PO and R two. That's a f- fan service. It doesn't affect the plot. Two PO is like Scarif. They go into Scarif. Yeah, it's but like, they okay. would be there. If they would if be, they're, but if they're on that transport show. I mean, it's cool to see them. They made that whole scene just to show them talking. It's like they, they could have been in the keep background. Anthony Daniels. Right. In all nine movies. Right. He's not in Solo. <laughs> or not, yeah, all all nine Star Wars, Skywalker saga movies. Yeah. But anyway, but yeah, going back to Star Tours. Yeah. Got nothing. Right, so a Mando update. Something will be cool. Yeah. Um, I think a new festival is going to be announced at Epcot, and it's going to be the Festival of Music. Oh, my gosh. Because, so that's year-round. Because, because, A, it's easy to do. B, it's kind of an abstract thing. But also Universal is talking about doing a country music festival. So oh, this could be that. this could be their answer yeah. to that. So I think yeah. that's something that is likely. Plus, you can throw in the the new hits. And Kanto is like super music yeah. heavy. People like Soul for some reason. Soul is very heavy on music. I, I didn't like Soul. No, I didn't, I didn't, didn't like it. it at all. It's because the guy was black. Where's yeah. the misogyny alarm? One hundred percent. We're no, all no, racist here. Confirm. Obviously, obviously joking. Um, yeah, I hate that I have oh. to say that every time. Same. People are dumb. If you're listening to this, you know I'm not an asshole. I mean, you know I'm an asshole, but I'm not a racist. <laughs> big um, difference. I guess people would say <laughs> it's a big difference. I guess people would say like Festival of the Arts, they do do music, but like having a festival so focused solely on music, like yeah. just the Instagramable stuff you could do with like treble clefs and notes and that kind of shit would yeah. work. Uh, I don't know. It's just an outside thought, but I think it's it's not it's not opening super act. Likely, you and Tom. Probably, oh, dude, hell yeah! We'll Pretty just play cool. Master of Puppets. Yep. Uh, but yeah, what else you got? Um, shoot, that's it for domestic parks. I kind of randomly today threw on, for Disney+, Plus. I think we get Tales of the Jedi release date and maybe, like, an exclusive clip of Mando Season 3. Good call. Both of those are very likely to happen. I was, I don't know why I focused only on parks on this. Me too. That's why I was like, this is the only thing I got that's not parks. It's just more fun so. to talk about the parks. Who's yeah. a shit about Disney I didn't Plus move cares. here for Disney+. Plus. I yeah, have Disney+, right. Plus everywhere. Correct. I moved here for the parks. Um, I think that it is very likely, my next one, um, that Rock and Roller Coaster gets a retheme. Simply for the mm-hmm. fact 
that yeah. Aerosmith sold their music catalog, catalog to Universal Music. Yeah. So I think I've been saying Incredicoaster for years is what we're getting. I but, think so. Yeah. I think it's more likely now than ever, and I think it's probably going to get announced, especially with. I hate to say that they're controversial because to me they're not, but like his drug no. issues and stuff in the past. But, but I mean, it's a rock freaking, band. Freaking Robert Downey Jr. Man, he was Correct. Iron Man. Look Correct. at all his yeah. controversial past. That's I love true. Robert Downey Jr. That's I true. love Iron Man. Yeah. But if you're gonna claim I controversial I past, I don't like, think any any. And I, I hate that term. Everyone's done stupid shit. Yeah. And it's just a there's just a scale of stupid shit yeah. you've done. Uh-huh. Every, we all have the one thing that we think of is they were like, "Fuck, I wish I had done that." Yeah. Wish I hadn't done that. And because you did that, does that make you a terrible human? No, you're, you're not no. who you are in your worst moments. Because then, if that's the case, then you are who you are at your best moments. Yeah. So we're somewhere. Which in the we're both not. Yeah. We're all somewhere. Or in the you're both. You're not both. If that makes sense. Yeah. Uh, yeah. You're 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 a combination of experiences. That's a different conversation for a much deeper time when I'm drunk. That'll be funny though if it is <laughs> if it is something rock and roller coaster. Because I mean I'm I'm not saying that I spawned this obviously, but I have I still have the letter at home. I have it in the envelope. Did you ever write Imagineering when you were a little kid? No. I wrote them after watching Monsters, Inc. And I was like, you guys need to make a roller coaster. That's the doors. Hanging from the doors, roller coaster. You need to make this. So then they wrote me back and were like, we can't take outside ideas from the company. We like how creative you are, yada, yada. That's super cute. Here's the autograph picture. Like, it was very sweet. It's oh, awesome. that's cool. I have it in the old school, like, eight. You need to find 90s. that. Oh, I have it. It's, I know where it is exactly. I look at, at it every now and then. Here. It's, it's here? It's in my apartment. Why haven't you ever posted that? I don't know, I'll I'll show you next week. I need to bring it and show yeah, you. Yeah, that's awesome, um, man. So then, like, obviously, decades pass, and then everyone's like, "Oh, I think Rock and Roller Coaster is gonna get a retheme to Monsters Inc." There's an old story and about like, this that cool they accidentally it uploaded it to the Cub, yeah, the cast member port, like cast member website, and yeah. then pulled it down. Yeah, and there's like a there's a if you look up um, anyone who's listening to this, look let's type in like Disney Dish podcast canceled Monsters Inc. ride. And the episode should pull up because it was a fascinating story about what all went down. It was supposed to happen. They yeah. stole your idea, bro. Well, they were stealing our ideas since when you were fucking kids, son. It's funny, though, because like, <laughs> I, f- I think in the letter, they're like, we can't even use this idea because you've sent it to us or something. So That's hilarious. I'm not saying it's connected because that'd be ludicrous to say. But if it does get rethemed I'm, to say it. Credit Coaster, <laughs> it, I'd be okay with it. You know, I love Rock and Roller Coaster. I'll say my goodbyes, but then I'll go right in Credit Coaster. Like, I, it's fine. It's a roller coaster to me. Like, yeah. It's just so loosely themed in the first place. It's like yeah. it's more themed out like a parking garage than it is like yeah. Aerosmith. Honestly, yeah, that little cue I love when it, you launch, la- or you're watching the launch is super cool. That's yeah. the best part. When you're in the, I, the back alleyway watching the launch. Don't get me wrong. I would miss it. but Same. But it's not in my like top <sighs> 10 rides, so like, it's, it's fine. Uh, yeah, I don't think it's in my ten. There's so yeah. many good rides. I mean, it would be. It's in my top twenty. Yeah, it's in my top twenty. I don't know. Before That'd I be moved here, one. though, it was in my top like five. Yeah, but, I think. So. But I think also, me too. new things have opened since. Yeah, then, so I think, like, yeah, I think. I think back when like, I was a kid, I would have said it was one of my favorites. Yeah. Uh, all right, moving on to the next one because we gotta get through this. Gotta, we gotta get you out of here, bro. Gotta go party. Um, I am fully convinced Happy Ever After is coming back with updates, and I put Princes and Kanto. <laughs> Thank the Lord. Uh, Thank it the needs Lord. to. Well, as, as much as Jordan Fisher's been like p- tagging Disney on Twitter and stuff, being like, hey, you bring it back. Me over, well, guys. And also, like, this show sucks, and everyone knows it sucks. And it's. Have you seen the Walt update? I haven't yet. yet. I haven't, I haven't either. I, have not, I was hoping I could see it tonight, but I just, they don't do it on It's just been raining nights. every night. Like, yeah. I, don't have, I haven't had a chance to I'm get gonna it. I'm going to go later next four. month when it's not raining, because yeah. I'm going to watch it. I'm gonna watch it as soon as I can. I might, I might yeah. go may, make it a uh, thing to do this weekend, like on the way out. Yeah, but uh, that's the yeah. best way. Uh, definitely. What, you, what else you got? That's my entire list. Oh, okay, so, so I I'll, just did I'll plow through these. The then. two domestic parks and one Disney Plus. Um, I'm fully convinced it is a likely announcement that you get the Galaxy's Edge restaurant at Disneyland, oh, especially yeah. with the completion of the Halcyon. They've probably fabricated duplicates of the Crown of Corellia dining room. I wouldn't be shocked if it pops up in some form. Yeah, just different aesthetics. No joke though. If, if that does happen. We need all three of us should go together. Hundred percent. Oh not, yeah. Like that's not. We'll oh, make yeah. it happen. Hundred. Oh no no. Absolutely. Yeah. Absolutely. Like oh, maybe as close to opening day as possible. But if it's I'm not, not opening oh, no, day, we'll go opening day. We'll be okay. there opening day. Hundred yeah. percent. If that happens, fuck yeah, dude. Yeah. Absolutely. Um, and then I think this is uh, an inevitable, but a new DVC at Walt Disney World because that one <laughs> got reflections or reflections. nope no nope. the reflections is gone. I I don't think that land was sustainable for buildings. I don't think yeah. it got I don't think it was budgets because they would make a crap ton on D V C back. They're not worried about that. Yeah. I think it was when they did like they started doing construction. They were like this land this land wasn't yeah. what's the word I'm looking for? Sustainable Buildable. Buildable. Whatever. Constructible. Yeah. Constructible. Whatever. All right. And so then I mean we got one at, at the poly now, the poly D V C. Yeah. So you like, might get more details on that. Yeah. Which god damn it. 
Um, R.I.P. Spirit of Aloha. <laughs> drives me insane. It doesn't even look poly. It just in- anyway. Um, part three is my blue sky slash highly unlikely slash not going to happen, but it's <laughs> fun to dream. Um, I think the fantasy land is going to get an expansion at Disneyland. Um, uh, expansion might be the wrong word. Redo might be the better word, but yeah. they're going to redo it at some point to make it look like new fantasy land. Yep. Uh, add frozen. They'll probably take away Mr. Toad, <laughs> which oh, I hate to say. Dang, I do too. But, uh, I, if I, that's the case, I'm making a trip to ride it before it closes. I'll ride that thing the entire day. We'll chain ourselves to it. 100%. Like, <laughs> It'll be just like back in the day when they did it, to, when they had the Save Toad campaign here. Yep. yep. Um, I think that it is l- not likely, but it would be fun if a Dino Land slash Dinosaur replacement gets announced. Ooh. I'm holding on hope for Mystic Manor. That's my outside. you got to have dinosaurs in Animal Kingdom. That's you my outside. Gotta. That's my outside. I want call. Mystic Manor, but I don't want to lose dinosaurs i'm okay with like, losing dino land dino land sucks i want a good dino land i don't want uh, to get rid of it i want to get rid of no. this one to get a good one oh, can't be mystic. dude come on you i want mystic manor would, but i also want dinosaurs you'd rather have dino land than mystic manor i want both because animal think, kingdom what, has to have dinosaurs. your head you have a you, you're in charge you keep dino land over mystic manor i just put really dino, i put Th- mystic manor somewhere now. else it's a spinner in arcade games get rid of that then well no that's chester and hester's dino that's what i'm talking about yeah get rid of that yeah yeah that's what i mean dino land keep but what is dino land is that the whole the area? The rest of Dino Land. Oh, I don't give a shit about There's it. There's Chester and Hester's Dino Rama. Well, you just, I'm talking about that little shitty parking yeah, lot. Yeah, get rid of that. Yeah, for, that's what I was percent. talking about. I was like, you want to fucking Triceratops spin no. instead of. Okay. I, I don't page. think I've ever done Triceratops spin. I have once. It's like, really, I think I need to do it. It's fucking just once. Aladdin. Yes. It's, it's Aladdin. Or the Teacup. Or, 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 uh, or uh, Dumbo. Dumbo. Or it's the same thing. Astro Orbiter is the best one. So like, oh, Astro Orbiter is dope. Yeah. I like Astro Orbiter. Yeah. It's just a pain in the ass to get to. It is. All right. I also think that. This would be if they really wanted to drop the fucking hammer and tell show Universal who's their bitch. Which they should, but they're not gonna. They're not gonna. Uh, one new major e ticket ride at each of the four parks. That would be insane. We all would lose our stuff. <sighs> be insane. Um, I think another thing that I wish would happen but is not gonna happen: the Quinjet ride from Avengers Campus. I just don't even see where that would go. I think go that's now. like five years away. Like I think it's gonna happen. But I don't know. If it is five years away, and it's gonna open in five years, they gotta do some sort of. Well, there's like three started. Avengers movies coming out between now and then, so you got plenty of Avengers to use. Yeah, yeah, it's true. I didn't even think about that. Yeah, that's a good point. Um, but I don't think they're gonna say anything about that. Also, this I got to thinking about this today. I think Joe Rody resigned for a reason. Yeah, yeah, he did. And I he think saw it's, what was going on. I, but I think it was specific. I think that we are not privy to these meetings. But I, I had this no. thought. Remember when the rumor was going around that Zootopia was coming to Animal Kingdom? And he spoke and out he was against like, it. No. Yeah. And I think they were like, shut the fuck up. Yeah. It's not your part. Like, who writes you your paycheck? It. You made it. Yeah. It's ours. Yep. Is it and called Joe like, Rody's Animal Kingdom? No, like, it's out. called Disney. And Animal he was like, Kingdom. I'm out. And I think they're going to go through with it here. Oh, I'm going to cry. Yeah. Cause We've already lost a- one park. <laughs> like, at least we'll still have magic in studios. But then <laughs> Animal's dead at that Dude, point. Studios like, was the first part to get killed. But it improved. Uh, it, it, it might the only have thing in, we lost was great movie, right? It might have improved in the sense that, uh, whoa, look who, look, it who it look who it is! Look who it is! It might have improved in the sense that, like, <laughs> <laughs> it might have improved that the quality of stuff got better, but it completely altered the theming of the park. I mean, True. it's a completely different park now. True, and they changed the name Epcot, to reflect like, it. They need to change yeah. the name at the other parks. But that like Epcot, at least, is like still similar enough. Where it's like they still have test track. They still have. Yeah. There's nothing that resembles old studios except Indiana Jones Stunt Spectacular. Yep. That's it. It's holding on. Um, then I think uh, speaking of Indiana Jones, Indiana Jones coming to Animal Kingdom, not going to happen. But it'd be cool no. if it did. That'd be super crazy if it was like Mystic Manor, then Indy right there back to back. Like what's going on over right. in that corner of the park? Um, then I think there's going to be some sort of update, and ex- and I'm using the quote expansion, but I don't mean expansion the way we think expansion. I think a Halcyon update is going to happen. Yeah, and I, I think agree they're going to come out and be like, you mean they're going to raise the, the price? guest rave reviews have been so insane, which it, it is, but I'm I'm mocking Bob Chapek. I'm not mocking the Halcyon. Yeah, they've been so incredible. But what we want to do is make sure more guests get to experience what's on the Halcyon and get them excited for their We're gonna future. We're going to have a stay. coupon day. Uh, they're going to have like a lunch or dinner or something. That's what we all want. That's Dude, what I'll go. I'm not kidding. Two hundred fifty dollar dinner once a month. Why I'm would there. you not do it? You're already yeah. making the food. Yep, do it. I think it'd be really cool. And we yeah. were there on Batu Day. We were like the only people in the restaurant. There's plenty of yeah, space. So I've done you that before. You wouldn't even. Yeah. You wouldn't notice it. Last uh, the last time, the only time so far that I've went. Yeah, we got back early from Batu Day, and no, no one's, one's on there. the ship. I mean, the I, think, I think we literally saw like four people. Wasn't there like four people in the room? I didn't even see that many. Yeah, 
Yeah. It was nuts. Yeah. And they had and all the food was out just sitting there. I'm like, this is nuts. They're preparing all this food. I mean, you have to prepare for everybody who's on board. And they've got like 30 of those shuttles. There's so many yeah. of those shuttles. So just yeah. like, what's using two of them to take people back and forth? And then my third blue sky, or my last, sorry, my last under, under my part three. So I, you'll, you'll hear this if you listen back, but I broke up the announcements into update slash backtracking. <laughs> <laughs> and then That's I did my part. Uh, part two li- likely announcements and then three blue sky slash highly unlikely announcements. And so my last one is obviously the rumored fifth park that always pops its head up every few years. Uh, that would be, if you really wanted to, I mean, the, the four e-ticket attractions would be dope. Well, but if you really wanted to slap the parks you have. Yeah, you correct. Can. That's not going to help capacity. Um, but I think that would be a way to for, uh, tell Universal, go fuck yourselves, we're still in charge. Yeah. But that was fun. I'm glad we got to do that. It was a little longer than I thought we'd go, but that's okay. That's definitely okay. Master so, Yoda, is there, is another, there another episode of Jedi this week? No. Is this the last episode of Jedi Talk this week? No. No, there is another. There is another. Uh, it's backwards. <laughs> Rush, Jedi.